What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. We got my Mustang back here behind us. Today is a special day. I'd like to formally welcome CM Components to the channel. Today is something I've been waiting on for a long time. It is here. Something very, very special to dress up the interior of this car just a little bit more. Normally when I get a package, I'm like, you know, Christmas present time. And I have been putting this off for a couple of days to make this video because I wanted to get my first reactions on camera. I wanted it to be true, real, and authentic. So let's go. Guys, if you are like me, we all have our favorite things we've done to dress up our cars. Whether it's a twin turbo kit, whether it's an Anderson composite hood, whether it's suspension, whether it's springs, whether it's exhaust, whether it's interior pieces, all of it. I have been hiding this from you guys, but inside of this box, is what this video is all about. All right, let's get this camera angle perfect. It's gotta be perfect. Here we go. I'm so excited, guys. This is like a late Christmas present right here. I know you guys are wanting to see it, but I get to see it first. Hang on. Oh my God. Oh. Oh. I don't I don't know what to say. Oh man, this is this is um yeah I started filming I was gonna make this a little bit special and everything and uh I am speechless. Let me show you what we got. Here we go. Out of everything that I have done to the Mustang, this car is beautiful. We've done it's been torn apart so many times. We put it back together. And now it's as fast as it ever has been. On 93 pump gas, it's making over 800 horsepower with a twin turbo kit. Um, we got the big tires. We got suspension all over the car. We got all of this stuff done to this. It's a heavy build. Please check out the channel if you are new. Subscribe. Turn your notification bells on. There's like 400 videos that we have. There's something for everybody, I promise. But this, this is something. But guys. Look at that. This is the best one that I've ever seen that he's made. I can't believe it. Guys, what this is, is a rear seat delete from CM Components. These are handmade. Jason has been teasing me for, it seems like a couple of months now. <laughs> yeah, let me get the plastic out of the way. I wanna be really careful. Okay. The hardware, I got some instructions. All right, so. You guys know, before we get into this, you guys know that uh, we've done a little bit of weight reduction in the car. So we got a race seat. We have no interior back here. And uh, it's just because we're doing race car things, but this is made out of wood, some cloth, and this is all custom right here. This is absolutely amazing. You can certainly make your own rear seat deletes. I've done it in the past, but for the price that these things cost, it is uh it's a no-brainer honestly so what we want to do <laughs> is carefully install this and uh dress up the interior just a little bit this is so cool this this car is pretty much the mascot of the channel i mean it's had it's got a full story it's been hit a few times it's been wrecked it's we got a blown motor we got a new one we got twin turbos we got all this stuff and we're going to be chasing nines this year low nines but this is so cool and it doesn't weigh anything at all so yeah we're probably only gonna add let's pick up yeah the whole box is like probably under five pounds i would imagine so um definitely not going to be adding too much weight back into the car that's important because we want to go you know somewhat race car but this guys i can't believe this all right let's install it and see what it looks like in the car this is amazing thank you so much jason guys if you want to buy these i'll link everything down in the description but you can use code Xander13 to save a bunch of money if you want to order one of these. And he can do all kinds of stuff. So you can get them flat black. Um, you can get whatever logo you want to engraved. It can be color or not. Um, they even do ones where they cut out the center section and they have logos and then you can run them up to like some LED lights. All right guys, you know how we do, all hands on. So I'm gonna take my seat belts out too in the rear. So this comes out easy enough, you just give it a couple of tugs. You don't have to take your seat belts out, but I'm just, we will get you, you coming out. Oh, 
what we need to do next is right here you got a bracket behind here we need to get rid of that because the new seat delete has some push locks on it so it's going to go in place of this but we do have to cut our carpet right here so this is somewhat of a i guess you can call it a permanent modification but anyway we're just gonna come about right about there oh that's thick perfect so just like that that way we can get here and this is where that bolt's gonna come through. I'll show you in just a second. So, T40 right here, we're gonna get this out of here. Same thing over there. T40, Torx bit. There's one on the other side too. I'm gonna do a little bit more cutting. Shouldn't have to go too far. If you were to put your seats back in here you could always put your brackets back on so in a sense this is reversible for those that care but for me i don't oh this stuff is really thick your are basically cutting through plastic all right i can at least get there Weight reduction. Weight reduction, here we go. <laughs> There's gonna be a, a push lock bolt that comes through. It should be the inner side, but we're gonna get this one done and then we'll be able to put the back in here. And uh, this is gonna be like a five minute install. All right guys, the easiest way to do this, what you wanna do is go for the inside hole right there. So they're adjustable, so we're gonna have to figure out the length that we need just in a second, but there's no good way to really get your hand back here. So, but what you can do, Hold that through. Now there's a hole right here. I can actually get my hand this way. So just don't drop any of your hardware. Let me backtrack. You gotta put this on first. Spin this on there. We'll go ahead and slide that just like this. A washer through the hole. You can feel in the back the stud very carefully. Same thing with this nut. I'm gonna leave mine a little loose. That way we can test fit. This is what we're dealing with. These push locks, that's what's gonna hold them in place. This thing is so sweet. I hope this video comes out well, but what we're gonna do is get this aligned and just kind of play with it and see if we need to come in or out with this push locks. I think we're actually about good right there. So to get it off, push the button, push the button and it drops free. This is cool because once it's actually in the car, you can just easily remove it and then you have access to your trunk which is really sweet. This whole thing, this whole design is is really cool to be able to, I mean, if, if you are really weight conscious, I mean, if you wanted to shave another maybe five pounds, it's too easy to take this thing out. And the other one, the bottom side, just goes into a bolt back here. So we are almost at a wrap. So we're about to mount this thing up, but look at that. Look how this is starting to turn out. I still gotta put the push locks up in place there, but I mean this, 100% worth it guys. The cool thing is you can completely customize them any which way that you want. This is so sweet. I absolutely love this. Thank you again so much, Jason. This is amazing. We have the finished product. So we have the rear down, which is simple enough. So basically the way this works is underneath there we have a bolt. It's a factory bolt that you'll take out of the spot right there and just put it back. But yeah, everything is pretty good fitting. Um, the cool thing again is that you can just take that out uh, pretty easily just by pushing those buttons and then if you wanted this out it's as simple as just taking that 15 millimeter uh, bolt out and then just sliding it out of the car. It installs like a breeze. It'll come out like a breeze. It weighs next to nothing. I'm completely sold. Again, seam components is where you're going to find this. All links in description and across the screen. But use promo code Xander13 right there to save some money. But yeah, guys, this is uh, again one of those special things that just dresses up the interior a little bit. I want to see what it looks like from a distance. Wow. Yeah, that's pretty cool. So you don't have to get colors again if you don't want to. You can get just, you know, some sort like a, a subdued, like engraved. Or you could have that center section right there cut out for some LED lights. It's pretty cool. Um, this is so sweet. I love this. It's just one of those little custom things that uh, when you see it in person, you're like, wow, look at that. Something. I wish the sun wasn't right there, but that is so sick. 
It looks so good. <laughs> Look, it just peeks through the window there. That's so cool. I love it. It's different. This entire build, this entire car is really coming together, guys. That's going to wrap up this video. Hopefully you like it. I absolutely love it. I know I've said that like a million times in this video, but this is just really special, really cool. Um, again, one last shout out to Jason, CM Components. I uh, appreciate it. And uh, yeah, we're going to take care of it, but there you go. So that's going to wrap up this video, guys. Pretty easy install. Looks good. I love it. And I'll see you guys in the next video.